right, let's take a look at Beaver Creek. This is a dexterity style game, and you just saw us play it live a few weeks ago on the Dice Tower. But in case you missed that, let me show you how it plays. Everyone's going to start with a certain amount of logs. So in a four or five player game, you'll have six of these big ones, four small ones. You'll start with two beavers on the back of the box here in these starting spaces, and then each player is going to roll dice on their turn. So one die is going to tell you how many beavers and logs you need to place. It's always going to be at least one of each. This one is two of each. The other die is going to tell you how to do it. So this one says, I need to place them with my non-dominant hand. So for me, that would be my left hand. When you place logs, you can place them in any order you want. Logs always must be on top of one beaver. So that would be fine. I could also, you know, if I could balance it on this, that would be fine. But if you ever let it drop and hit the table, your turn's going to be over and everyone else gets to discard one of their logs. Beavers come from a supply here in the middle and each beaver must go in a starting spot or they must go on top of another log. So as time goes by, you're going to see you're going to have all sorts of fun things happen. Probably not that. But again, I'm pretty terrible at this. So uh, if you have, remember each log has to go on top of a beaver, but it could also go on top of a log as long as it's touching one beaver. Again, if you mess up, you're going to have to discard one. The things that it has here, sometimes it makes you play with scissors. Sometimes you have to place a combination of the beaver and the log at the same time. Or new logs only touch beavers. You can't touch other logs too. You have to follow these rules. As soon as you drop something, if it hits the table, it's out. If it falls on here, um, you kind of let the stuff that falls on the board stay where it lands for now. But anytime you mess up, everyone else gets rid of a stick. First person to get rid of all their sticks is the winner. Beaver Creek is an enjoyable game that I think both kids and families are going to enjoy. It has all the ideas of, hey, put out supports, in this case the beavers, and put logs on top of them. It looks fantastic as you're setting it up, and it's quick and silly, especially with the other die making you do some weird thing as you place them down. This is definitely going to be geared more towards kids. I have one problem with the game, which is I don't like the end conditions in the sense that if on your final turn, you just drop a stick on there, you don't care if it messes up and because you're going to win. And they told me they're going to fix that in future editions where you can't win by also someone else messing up and your last stick going. Your last stick has to be placed properly for you to win. And in fact, that's how I'm going to play this version from here on out. But it's quick, it's simple, it's easy. This is one that I'm going to give a 7 to, but especially geared towards kids. I really like Beaver Creek.